You ready? Yep. Hi, I'm Arthur. And I'm Andrea. And we are Heavy, Heavy Metal, Metal Beer, Beer Club. Club. And today we are going to be tasting O'Fallon Jackolatte. Pumpkin coffee milk stout. There we go. And they are out of? Maryland Heights, Missouri. So stick around. Music. All right, let's taste this Jack O'Fallon. Oh, yeah. Let's uh, check this bad boy People, out. we haven't done one from home for a while. Did you miss it? Did you miss Ooh. our little setup? So th as you can tell, this is our Halloween show. Another <laughs> Halloween show. Wow. I can't wait to see what this is like. I we, we bought this a little bit ago to do a show mm. on, and I've been looking at them in our fridge, and I've been wanting to try it. That so. is nice. I like the pumpkin on there. And then it has little check marks here. It says hops. Malt. You know what? I've been wearing my glasses the whole time. <laughs> okay. It says, well, now I got to put them back on. It says uh, hops, malt, coffee, and pumpkin. Check marks. Yep. Check. And uh, see what this bad boy tastes yeah, like. Let's sure. smell it. We did a pretty good job this season of finding all the pumpkin beers that we could at the brew houses. Oh, yeah. So we've scouted them out everywhere. And uh, uh, so this should be fun to try. Can't wait. It has a nice sound. dark brown color. Yeah, nice dark. Mm, it smells kind of Ooh, milky and creamy. Yeah, it does. Sounds like uh, Sm it's, smells, it smells. It smells like a. It smells like a nice stout. Yeah, it does. Mm. Yeah, I'm not getting a. a overwhelming I, I, sweetness I, or anything. I smell the spices. Yeah, you smell the spices. spices in yes. There? Let's give it a little taster. All right. Mmm. Mmm. That's very good. Yeah, I'm getting this like pumpkin. You get the spice right off the off the top and then the little coffee like the latte part of it all so you get the coffee bean in it and the and the spices yeah a little bit of cinnamon mm -hmm. yeah it's, not got, it's got a thinner to medium mouthfeel which means when we say that it means it's not really heavy and syrupy because some people don't like that so much this has got a nice right away spice and the coffee and that's a 5.9 percent alcohol by volume we'll this would be see. a nice seasonal sipper Oh, Fallon has a, that pumpkin, I, I saw the, uh, they have like a, a pumpkin pack that you can buy. We're gonna have to go pick up one of those. You saw that? Where did yeah, you see I that? Got, well, I saw it online when I was looking up. We need the pumpkin Fallon pack. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, Fallon. Yeah, I'd say definitely. If you're into pumpkin beers, you like stouts, you like a coffee stout. I know our good friend Sport in California likes that kind. Oh yeah. This would be right up your alley. And it's not overly sweet, not overly spicy, but it, it still oh. is seasonal. Yeah, very nice, but yet flavorful enough for like mm -hmm. somebody like me who likes real flavorful beers. Mm -hmm. It has enough flavor in it to mm -hmm. keep my interest for sure. You still get that little seasonal spice, you know, mm -hmm. that I look for when I see a pumpkin beer. I want to get a little of that spice. I even get a touch of, of sweetness on the malt. Oh yeah, for sure. What would you say on the tasty meter, which is on a scale of one through five? On the tasty meter, I would give this a 4.5. And I would go with a three. A three? Yep. All right. <laughs> Gosh. No, it's, I mean, it's it's tasty, it's but tasty, I guess yeah. with some of the other pumpkin beers I've had that were extremely mm -hmm. flavorful, mm -hmm. it's um, a little bit on the mild, milder side for me. But somebody who doesn't like all those crazy flavors would probably love this. Yeah. They don't want coffee in their pumpkin beer. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, it's very good. So yeah, 4.5 and you went with a three? Yeah. Okay, wow. We had a little difference of opinion on there. Got my talisman. Zap. Oh. Very good. And also we got, look at our goodies that, that we got here also. Oh yeah. Yeah. And uh, we want to thank uh, my buddy Leonard and Tina from- Thanks Leonard and Tina. From Kebea or Kebella Creations. And uh, I'll stick their Instagram so you can check them out. Check out all the items they have. Give them some love, please. And uh, yeah, thank you so much. We love these these items. I have, I think I, I have the uh, other coasters. These are cool, so these cool coasters heavy metal and he beer made club them. Coasters. Yeah, he yeah, these, made these are wood. And so it's not merch, this is for us. Yeah, it's real stuff. So thank you so much. Yeah, thanks guys. We really appreciate it. It's cool as heck. Hope you're enjoying the Halloween season. Have you been going to any Halloween concerts or functions or costume parties? Yeah, it's going to be nice this year to be able to go to a costume party. Yeah. 
We're going for our friends Bob's 50th. Send, put in your comments if you're gonna be something in particular or what you're doing. We'd love to hear that kind of stuff. Arthur's going to be a Smurf. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, if you could please put down in the comments, let us know what your favorite uh, pumpkin seasonal beer, or well, even seasonal beer, because we have all the Oktoberfests out, yeah. all the Martins. Yeah, what's your favorite? Yeah, let us know what you're drinking. And if you like this sort of content, please hit the like button and yeah. subscribe. subscribe. Subscribe to our tomfoolery and whatnot. <laughs> Cheers to you. Thank you so much for joining us here at Heavy, Heavy Metal, Metal Beer, Beer Club. Club. Stay safe, drink responsibly, and don't forget to stay, stay metal. metal. Pumpkin Coffee Milk Stout. There we go. And they are out of? I don't know. Where are they from? <laughs> it's... Uh, Remember? Maryland Heights, Missouri. Okay. And say, where are they from? And where are they from? Maryland Heights, Missouri. <laughs>